Hello and welcome, it's Joey Cube and I'm here on the Sunshine Coast in Queensland, Australia. Coming to um, a pour with a bit of challenge from my son, as we've been doing a few collaborations together that you will have seen if you follow my um, YouTube channel. So he's an airbrush artist, so what he has done is challenging me to um, just do a pour on the white side. He has masked off all of this um, and he's done me three canvases. So he's masked off where he wants to do his bit. He's give me mum's paw so, and the arrows. So I'm presuming that he swipe up that way or maybe a blow, I'm not sure. So I'll figure that out. He's done another one where mum's paw Again, he's, he's put his bit and wants me to do whatever on there. And he's done a third one. He's taped off all the area that he wants his art to go on. And then this on my side, this one has got something here. And so I'm just gonna merrily go through these challenges that my son has set, set for me. Cheeky boy. I'll start with this one. So obviously the second part of it you will see when he does his airbrush and he's obviously going to remove all this after I've done my pour. So on with it, I will get on with it. So first of all, I'm thinking that I better put some gloves on. Um, Rightio. So the challenge begins, the challenge begins. So it shouldn't be a very long video because I haven't got much to do, have I? I am not sure whether I need to fill the whole of this side with different things. I think I might keep it pretty basic. Ooh, this is just a grey that I had left over that I'd pre-mixed and I just uh, always pour it in my empty glue containers because they're obviously just as good as any other that you buy you just re um recycle so i'm going to just put that that gray base on and i'm going to try not to go too much over his tape so it's easy for me to get off for him to do his bit so i'll just go up to the tape and over the edge with my bit so i'm not sure if i yeah i want to leave a bit of negative area for him i suppose i'm not sure i sort of i thought oh i don't like challenges because i just like to go my own merry way i'm at that age in life that i think oh but I'm trying to encourage him to keep his painting up because he had a long time that he wasn't um, into his art. So, and he's so talented that I've got to try and encourage him, haven't I, as a mother? You've got to try your best with your kids. So, that is the grey. Just put a little bit extra on as you do. And I've got some colour. I don't too much so I'm going to I keep saying that don't I maybe if I do just small areas of swipes so that was my berry delicious that I make up myself out of bright red phalo blue and a blob of black. This is magenta. I'm not sure whether I should blow this paint or swipe it. What do you think? What do you think? Oh my goodness, the decisions. I will go a bit of white. I'll try the swipe in these and I'll, I'll just see. I mean, I can always change and um, do something else, I suppose. I've got a small uh, piece of, it's just soft plastic file divider. So I'm going to use this to do my swipe. 
that's turned out weird. Sort of gone into big holes. That's got all sorts of pouring medium here, different pouring mediums instead of just one consistent one that I normally would use. that I don't particularly like that sort of chunky thing that's appeared in there but anyway I've just dipped my paint in that just that one color to see if it looks any better That's a bit of a weird one, that. I'm not liking how this has gone so sort of big and holy, but I'm gonna leave it. Okay, I'm leaving that as it is, um, and I'm going to, um, then you'll see what Scott's um, contribution to this and bring this all to life. So I hope you enjoy, enjoy it. And um, yeah, until the next exciting episode, here it comes.
Well, there you go. And that's where the magic all happened, isn't it? Look at the detail in this piece. Just a lovely lilac. Um, he did a really good job with this. So happy with it. So happy for him that he's really enjoying these collaborations with his mom, which is a really nice thing, isn't it? And I am very, very proud of him. So I hope you consider hopping over to Scott's YouTube channel and uh, subscribing. Um, it's obviously a different kind of generation than I'm doing. He, he you know, can do some weird and wonderful work, but he'll appear to a younger generation, I guess. But these pieces he's doing with me is being respectful of my uh, particular style um, and I'm enjoying it. he's enjoying it so I hope you are too thank you so much for joining us you are tremendous um, please subscribe if you haven't subscribed and I'll be back tomorrow so until then you lovely people bye for now